So we're going to put the tegular curb edgings in now to a curve. So obviously curves are a little bit trickier to do because you can't run a string line to it, apparently, but you can in theory. So I've got four string lines. There's one right in front of me, can't see it. Another one there, another two over there. So I've gone from two courses down from damp roof course to the finished height of the drive here. So they're going across, so that's determining my levels. And what I've done, I put some pegs in the ground and I put them so they correspond with the string lines. And you can do bend it then around the wall. See? Bend it around the wall to the height I need. And you kind of can lay a string line to a curve. It's tricky, but very doable. So, uh, yeah, little tip of the day. Yeah, I did a bit of a bit of a slight epic fail then regarding that string line I was showing you earlier. I needed to um, put it to the top of the bloody pavement, didn't I? Not where it was, so I've just adjusted it. So I basically got to follow this line. And that should take me to corresponding height, because over here I've got to go 160 mil higher than the actual bottom of the pavement. So the bottom string line there is the actual paving. Two courses of bricks is 150 mil. So I put that in there. That's pretty much the height I'm after. So yeah, slight bit of adjusting with my curved string line. But now I can start plonking them in properly. So now I know that curve is what I'm after. Put the paver on the top, touching the string line. Jobs are good. I hope. So find out. So there we go people, you can lay to a curved string line, which I done on here. So yeah, finished a little bit abruptly by that bit there, that's because my fat ass was in the way. But yeah, you can lay to a string line to a curve, hence that's what I've just done. Well anyway, it's almost Christmas, like and subscribe people, happy Christmas, see you in the new year. Oh, 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 oh,